What's up, YouTube? Today we're going to review the Moon Gel Workout Pad. You've seen other practice pad videos on my channel before. I'm going to show you why this one is my go-to pad. First off, the color of this thing is kind of a clear blue. It's pretty neat. It's also got something to mount it underneath, which is nice if you don't want to have to lug around a snare stand with you everywhere you go. Sometimes I'll have it just mounted beside my kit. Two, the feel of this thing. You can see my thumb going into there. It's not a, uh, a foam or a hard plastic or anything like that. It's got its own feel. What I'm going to do is I'm going to play about five different pads so you can hear them. I'm going to leave a large diaphragm condenser mic with no EQ, no gates, no compression, no reverb, and you're going to hear the difference between each pad. I'm actually going to mute this mic while I'm playing. First off, let's hear the Moon Gel pad by itself. In the room, that thing is quiet. This is the quietest pad I have ever played. One thing you'll notice when I'm just doing a, uh, a roll, you'll see my fingers having to engage every stroke. Those guys that have, you know, pinkies and fingers off the stick, you're not getting free bounces on this thing. I'm sorry. Um, I recommend starting really slow with this thing and making every hit very deliberate. And as you get faster and faster, you'll notice, hey, my fingers aren't leaving the stick. This thing, if I play the same amount of time on any other pad, my arms are way more tired. I'm using my fingers, I'm using my forearms. This thing is a workout. Now let's do a comparison with a few other pads that I own. First off, I got the Billy Hyde Natural Rebound Pad. This pad has a loud pitch and it's a higher pitch. You're gonna hear this if you're warming up beside a band that's on stage. Uh, this pad does have less rebound than some of the rubber pads I have though. You'll notice that the volume of this thing, I can hear it, it's very uh, high pitch. Two. Those guys that have their pinkies out. A little bit of a free rebound from this thing. Not as much as others. Next up, we have the Prologix Blue Lightning. Out of all the pads I'm showing you, this would be the closest pad, but it is still not as much as a workout as the Moon Gel Workout Pad. This pad is relatively quiet. I still think the Moon Gel Pad is also quieter than this pad. Now, the Prologix Red. This one's fun when you want to boost your confidence because of the rebound. Uh, you can play a lot faster on this one. Also, if you notice, do the pinkies out test. You're getting a lot more bounce from this thing. Finally, the Evans Real Feel. A lot of people have this pad. It's good for learning on something like an incredibly tight snare. To me, it feels like playing on a coffee table. Uh, it's not quiet. And uh, let's just try same rudiment on this one. Now, if we go back to this moon gel pad, it's very quiet. I find I'm having to work twice as hard to get the same results out of this thing. I'm actually a bit slower on this pad than the other ones, but my technique has improved night and day playing on this thing. Uh, I can't recommend this enough, especially if you're one of those guys that is having trouble with, say, your left hand, uh, your pinky's coming off, someone that just is having a hard time getting speed, your fingers keep leaving the sticks. Just working on singles on this thing for a long time. You learn how to keep your stick heights down and use every little muscle fiber to get those strokes out. Uh, I would suggest going out and buying one of these. It's the best pad I've used. If you already have a pad, I still recommend getting one of these. I sometimes will put three different pads to have three surfaces beside each other, do double strokes across them, paradiddles, other rudiments, and just move them around. When you're playing on a kit, every surface has a different feel. Every drum set has a different feel. Don't get used to playing on one surface. One of these, makes playing on a floor tom easy. Your fills will get louder, your strokes will sound more confident. Uh, when you're doing a double stroke on the floor tom, your band's gonna wonder what happened. So there it is, 10 out of 10, Moon Gel Workout Pad, go grab one.